Hello and welcome to my book review for today. Happy Sunday, everybody. I think I'm doing this every day, but it might be a while before I do another one because uh, I'm not even close to finishing any other books yet. So, yeah. All right. Mira. Or Mira? No, Mira. Tiebreaker um, by Danielle Page. Love the cover. And I'm giving it three stars. So, it was interesting to learn about Mara. And in this book, in this um, version of her, she is very um, headstrong. And at this point, the Atlanteans are at war. Not really at war, but they have control over... And I'm probably saying this wrong... The Zebels? Her, her, let's say her, her people. Probably saying the name wrong and I don't know how to pronounce it. Anyways, so, she's, her father wants her to marry this dude and she doesn't want to marry him. And they want this Larkin guy to kill the Atlantean prince um, on shore. So, when she hears that, she's like, I'm going to kill him. So, she goes on shore and meets... The human, Arthur, who's supposedly the Arthurian prince. And things don't go as planned. Okay, so that's about the gist of it. I absolutely love the artwork throughout. Um, basically, what's cool is underwater, like, there's not much color except for her hair, which is really awesome. Um, the storyline was really good. I enjoyed it. I always like reading about characters um, that I don't know a lot about in graphic novel especially DC so I enjoyed it throughout and the ending was very good and it actually left open if they want to do a second book with this but I don't know if they will but all in all it was a great story and I recommend it if you like DC um, Aquaman and just graphic novels all around and it actually is a teen graphic so it's yeah basically and like I said, I love it the fact that the only color is her hair throughout. It's just so great. Really nice use of color. All right. So once again, um, it's Mira Tiebreaker. Um, and it's by Danielle Page. And I'm giving it three stars. Yeah. All right. <laughs> That's it for me today. <laughs> um, everyone have a great weekend. And today's my first day of my weekend, so I have tomorrow off to relax. And uh, happy reading, and I'll see y'all next time.